This is a preview of a boat that was made in the early 1980s by Finn and Feather Incorporated out of Marshall, Texas. This boat model is the Electric Feather Piro. What's electric about it is it has a built-in Minn Kota to 27 pound trolling motor. It has stainless steel skids here to keep the trolling motor from uh, hitting the bottom. And this is the control center. The knob is your left and right. And then you've got your switches for uh, different direction or different speed. And this knob on the bottom right here, I've bypassed all of the original um, three speed that was on here. And it now has a digital pulse modulator, uh, infinite adjustments on the speed. And and also that DPM really uses a whole lot less electricity. So something I've added onto this p row is I built a motor mount. And I have hanging off of that a 1956 Johnson three horse motor. Now, one thing to note about that motor, you see how the shaft is leaning, it's leaning forward. This motor was designed to run in shallow water. Whenever the motor is kicked up like that, the prop is pointing straight back for thrust. So that outboard set up for running shallow water. Usually I'll motor up the river with the outboard and then I'll troll and fish. Have a Scotty mount. Uh, there's a second rod mount in the back. Have the fish finder. This ice chest here, it is converted to a live well. And this plugs into a 12 volt uh, cigarette connection that I've got right down there so with that digital controller I can run a small AGM 12 volt battery it's um, it's, it's a 35 amp uh, but compared to when I used to put the full-size trolling motors in here uh, that were super heavy on the front end this this really lightens it up a lot and uh you know since i only use it for trolling i have yet to run out of power so it seems to be working okay you can see it's a it's a flat bottom boat uh this boat's very stable you can stand up in it and fish very stable boat now, i've got this on a highlander trailer and you can see it's pushed it's pushed back and look how much tongue i have on the front of that right there that's so the back door of my fj can open but also whenever i'm launching into an unimproved uh, creek bank okay that really helps as far as uh backing down into a creek creek bank with your truck so that gets the boat in the water a little bit sooner so really this boat is a tri-power. It's got the uh, 56 Johnson three horse. It has the built-in uh, Minn Kota 27 pound thrust trolling motor. That's two. And number three is it has onboard human paddling system. So that's about it. So say bye-bye to the P-Row.